Alright, hey guys, it's me, Alaska, here. So today, I'm gonna be playing my Pocket Galaxy Express. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm probably just gonna really mess around or something. I don't even know. But, you got, um, oh. Alright, I'm gonna put that over there for now. Alright, so, go ahead and take the earth right here. Um, let's see if that works. I'll launch Pluto to it, see if that works. Alright, and I think it's working. I'll just wait for it to completely slam into the earth. Oh god, snowball earth. Alright, perfect time. Alright, let's check on the Earth's temperature. Oh, that ain't looking good. Alright, we'll just speed up some of the process. Oh, uh oh. Alright, let me speed up that. Alright, the Earth. Oh, it's water back. Get rid of it. Alright. Smacking the Neptune. And make sure the Earth. What am I? What am I gonna do? Probably send the Mars this way. All right. This is a bit dumb. Nope. It just collided with the Earth. Oh, that ain't looking good. All right, Neptune, you're gonna experience the same thing. All right, let's speed up the process. Um, all right, and this looks a little bit fine. All right, how about we take this up to the next level? I apologize for the background noise. All right, what am I supposed to do? Just sit here, watch it burn. Alright, now, let me see if I can launch Jupiter into the habitable zone. Alright. Wait, make this like that. Actually, I think I had it too fast. Oh. Where am I gonna put this? This is annoying. Um... Come on. All right. What if we send Neptune into the habitable zone? All right. So, as you can see, it's currently. Oh, all right. Started. So, the habitable zone is the uninhabitable zone. Habitable zone. All right. Now, at this point. Alright, I'm sorry. Alright, let's see what happens now. Neptune is very close to... She... She hit toe. Oh, don't mind. Alright, let me get rid of this. Alright. Probably send the Saturn its way. Oh! I want to see if I can... Oh, ooh, ooh. Alright. What if we watch this a bit first? Okay, yeah, uh, the Earth is already hot at the Havoc zone, so probably we have to put it at the too cold zone in order for that to work. Nope, it's still the same. Alright. I hate making this. I'm not supposed to. Alright, now at this point, it should be habitable. <laughs> Alright, so at this point it seems to be habitable. What happens? Wait, I'm gonna try launching Pluto from here. There it goes. 
Um, I think it's being habitable. I don't really know. No, it's still pretty hot in there, so. Probably having life on she hit over. She hit toe is probably not even a big good idea anymore. All right, now we're gonna launch a Saturn that way. Uh. All right. Let's see what happens if we just. All right, slam. All right, now one of the craziest things to happen. There's a literal, there's a literal star that's disrupting the orbit of Jupiter. This ain't gonna be good. <laughs> no, Jupiter, no. All right, that's the death of Jupiter. Now what's gonna happen? We have Spectran, now have Shadow. Oh, all right, became a white dwarf. Not going to mess around with that. Let me just launch an Earth, see what's gonna happen to that. Huh? Expanding? Oh, shoot. What the heck? Oh, my God. Um, we probably made this into a collision course. No collision course. Actually, I have a much better idea in order to clean this dirty. Uh, get in there, get in there. Shankaro, Shankaro. Oh, not that. Alright, now that's all the end. So you might be wondering, what happens to satellites? If they hit each other. That's actually a good question. They just explode. So, speaking of gas giants... Um... I'm probably sending it over that way. Oh, it hits Jupiter. All right, let's make one of the weirdest collision courses. So, here's what would happen if Saturn and Jupiter and Saturn actually were on a collision course. So, of course, Saturn and Jupiter would start heading towards each other. At first, we all thought it's the Jupiter and Saturn conjunction. That's all. That happens. Alright, so now Jupiter is really scorching hot. So. Alright, at this point, Jupiter will actually start heating up, so. It doesn't even become a star. It was like expecting something that you wouldn't expect. Alright, now here's your. Ignis and Neptune. I don't even know what's happening anymore. Wait a minute. They're actually pulling towards each other. Okay. Alright. So, at this point, Uranus is now the only gas giant the and not gas giant i mean it is a gas giant but it's an ice giant at this point it would actually be i thought it was large enough to devour saturn all right we'll try this i'm not letting this go to waste so here's earth and mars see on there just explodes directly on contact so the oceans will evaporate and it will just become a whole ball of 
All right. Now, I actually discovered this. But Venus actually has water. And if you put Venus in the habitable zone, it would actually develop life. I don't even know why. It just does. It just does. All right. Now we'll do Mercury and Venus. Slam. All right. Oh, Venus is hot now. Oh, yeah, let me get rid of... Sorry about my dog's barking. All right. No more goofing off. We're going to launch Pluto at the moon. For some reason, it's named 0 0.2. I don't know why it's just named like that. Wait. Oh, yeah. Pluto doesn't, doesn't even have any mass, but the moon is already at full mass. Collides with the frozen moon. I apologize about my dogs barking. <laughs> Alright, what if we try this? Launch things at the Earth. Alright, now since the Earth has already swallowed Pluto, the Moon, Mars, Venus, and Earth, uh, Mars, Venus, and Mercury, now it's time for Jupiter to swallow all the gas, all the jo the other three Jovian planets. Let's go Saturn, there go Uranus, and there go Neptune. So. Jupiter and the Earth. Ah, I misclicked. No. All right. Wait, 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 wait. I don't want to mess with that. All right. Now the only collision course we need is the Sun. See both of those right there. You would see the sun going closer to Earth and Jupiter. Alright, it just slammed. Like, seriously. Alright, the... We already made a binary star system in the last video. Well, I haven't posted that video yet. Or so I wouldn't... Oh, 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 oh. Uh-oh. Goofing around. <laughs> There's so much nebula clouds around. We'll smack an ice planet right there. What the fuck? Bro, this is gone. Alright, that's all for this. And I'll see ya.